After living in China for a handful of years and currently waiting on a visa to eventually go back, I get really excited when Chinese New Year comes around. Especially to see all the different brands coming out with a Chinese New Year you know, sneaker or clothing. Uh, Nike does a great job, Adidas does stuff now and then, but this year I really really like Under Armour's. Now let me show you what I have. Obviously you clicked on this video, you saw the title so you know what it is, but no further ado, let's have a look here. I'm going to bring the box nice and close so you can see the description and right there I hope you can see that says UA Hover Phantom 2 CNY. So one more time that's the UA Hover Phantom 2 CNY as in Chinese New Year. Now I love the color on this shoe and if you don't already know Chinese New Year they celebrate with the color red. It has to go with, I, I'm not going to butcher it, but there's a myth and a legend about this creature coming to eat children and whatnot and they use firecrackers and the color red to make them disappear and you know, look it up, it, it's interesting. Anyways, I'm going to dive into the shoe and as I always do, uh, I usually take out the left foot, this time I'm going to take out the right foot and hold this shoe like that. Get that shadow out of my face. Sorry, my lights are hankering up. And now let's bring that in for a closer look. Let's bring the lights around so we can get a better view. And that is the shoe up front. All right, the lights are going to come in this side. And there we go. Wow. Now, the hits on this shoe are amazing. I'm not a huge fan of them making this bottom here white. I think if they made this part black and continued the theme or even did like this pattern here like the splatter there that would have been really cool but they did white anyways you can see they have the foam pattern looking on the inside and if we flip it around to the inside of the shoe they have the same thing here this responsiveness and this cushioning and the phantom 2 is amazing you can check my other video I do a review on another pair the Intellinet version uh, the green one and I really like that you know it goes with kind of what I'm wearing now this Marc Jacobs shirt but Anyway, so that's the inside. Rotate it around nice and slow. Look at the front. And this year, I believe, I haven't even paid a lot of attention. I've been so busy with uh, Toronto Film School and all this other stuff. You can see that it has the Under Armour logo, but also the Tiger, as in it's Year of the Tiger. Alright, another quick look. We got that hit of Under Armour in gold on the back. That's another very popular color, uh, Chinese New Year, the gold color. I love getting and giving his gifts for Rochers. They're delicious, but let's stick to the fashion right now. It's not a food channel. And then I love the splatter. And at the splatter, it has hits of gold splatter. And right now, the lighting kind of made it look like it has a little bit of hits of red, but trust me, this paint splatter here is all gold. Plastic heel cup, the tab says phantom along the side here and I can't really explain this here other than like a swirl of red and black uh, I don't know if it's supposed to be anything but yeah the hits and the colors you got a little bit of gray or black woven in on the toe box there and black and gold on the laces let me just show you the inside so a nice fresh pair comes with Sorry, the phone's in the background. Obviously, just paper. Because, you know, it's a running shoe. I'm going to throw these on right away and start beating them. On in the, uh, inside, it says Speed Form 2.0. Don't know if you can see that, but sock liner. Nice. Now, these, when it goes for the fit, I am a true to size 10.5. All my running shoes, almost everything is a 10.5. I can do size 11s in certain shoes, but this one, definitely for me, I am sticking true to size and last thing, let's look at the tread on the bottom of this shoe. Beautiful pattern again. You got a hit of that black, uh, red and gold Under Armour there. Anyways, that's the shoe. It's beautiful. Nice and lightweight. One more time, you can have a look at the box. That's how the shoes came. Just nice and simple. They don't over need to do it, right? Like, this is not a designer shoe. This is not a basketball shoe where they need to give you bells and whistles. This is a performance shoe. I'm not going to keep the box. I'm literally going to toss this in a second. But anyways, let me throw these on feet and show you guys how it looks on foot. Alright, here's a look on feet. 
They're actually really comfortable. I love this shoe. It, to me, this shoe compares to Ultra Boost. I think it's better than the Nike React. The responsiveness in it is great. Come down, nice squat. The insides, you hear that squeakiness. Traction's really good on it. Alright, I think that's enough on foot action for you guys today. Okay, so these sneakers. <laughs> I hope I gave you a little bit more insight on this pair of shoes, okay? Personally, I love this colorway. You know, black and red, it goes great. Even though I have so many other shoes that colorway already, especially Jordans, this to me is a keeper. You know, the sentimental value of it being Chinese New Year and with that thing and this place in time, you know, each Chinese New Year they have a different animal and it gives me a memory of what happened that year and I can always you know circle back to it so anyways i'm getting carried away i will wear this pair of shoes in springtime and summertime i already know a few fits i'm gonna pull off with it it's nice it's comfortable i can wear it all day long um that is that anyways i want to know what your guys opinion is on this pair of shoes um what do you compare it to is it good as an ultra boost or another shoe you find extremely comfortable do you have a pair or do you not like the shoe? I mean, I got a lot of positive feedback on the other colorway I did, the Intellinet version. But I want to, you know, hear what you guys think. So, anyways, till next time, take it easy.